Hello and uh, welcome to this quick video. Uh, in this video I'll just be showing you how you can um, download a really good plugin that I found for Adobe Premiere um, and it'll allow you to export to WebM which is uh, one of Google's really nice um, video for formats which is a lot smaller and has a pretty decent quality to it um, compared to some of the other formats out there. Um, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to uh, this page on GitHub, which um, is the plugin I found. Uh, it's created by um, this guy here, <laughs> and it's fairly new. Um, it was released in t December 2013, I think, and I'm sure it'll be updated. But it is only in beta. But uh, I'm using it in CS6, and it works very well. Um, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to scroll down to the bottom here and you're going to want to download whichever one's applicable to you. I'm on Windows. Um, so I'm just going to click here to download this version. That should then start downloading a zip file for that. Um, and when that downloads you should see the following pop up and open. Um, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to extract these to somewhere. I've already extracted them, so I'm not really going to um, do that. Let's just see if I can create a file on the folder on my desktop actually for you. So I can do it along with you. Sorry, it's been a bit slow. Right. Okay, so on my desktop I have a folder called WebM. I'm just extracting it there now. Right, okay, so these are the files you have. You have a README, and this will tell you how to actually install it. So if you open that up, which has been a bit slow. Okay, so once you've opened that up, it should look something a little bit like this. And it says, uh, what you need to do to install this is you need to copy the plugin to the uh, the correct folder. So for me, it's this one here. So we can just go there now. So I'll just copy this here. Let's just do copy. Actually, I'll open up a new window and do it that way. So... Just go to program files. Um, is it program files Adobe common plugins? Right. So Adobe common plugins CS6 MIDI core, and you just need to paste it into here. And uh, when you do so, you'll get a thing saying, "I sure you want to do this. You have to be an admin to do this." Blah blah blah. Just accept it and click yes. And then if you go and open up Premiere Pro whichever version you are running and you can just say to open up whichever project you like or create a new one whatever and then when it goes to it coming when it comes to actually exporting it if you go to file export media and then you can change it from whichever version it is at present and go down to webm and you can just export it exactly how it is now and you'll notice there's a massive difference in file size. Um, if I can just find my current directory, um, so here you can see two videos that I've encoded. They're exactly the same video, and they're both 1080p, and they're both pretty good quality. Um, these have shrunk down from a maybe a 60 gig file. Um, let's just see if I can find out for you. Well, I'd, I'd, probably about 30 gig actually, but either way it's gone from 30 gig down to um, 60 meg, or not 60 meg, sorry, 600 meg, which is the MP4, or if you want to do it to WebM, it actually goes down to about 200 meg. So that's a massive difference, and if you actually do this yourself and you compare both of them together, it is very difficult to see any difference whatsoever. Um, I've since uploaded it to... Uh, YouTube, which was a lot faster, obviously, because it's a lot smaller, and my internet here is pretty naff, and it plays just as it would any other video, it's still 1080p, and it looks exactly the same quality. 
So, um, I hope this video has been useful. Uh, please do give the guy who created this the credit that he deserves because I haven't found any other um, formats out, or there any other plugins out there that will actually allow you to do this. And um, it seems to work very well. So, he's the author and please give him all the credit because he's done a really great job. Thank you for watching and I hope this has been useful. See ya.